Let's see if we can do this again. I really should have had my camera with me both times. Um, that's Buddy over there. I actually saw him come down from, I'll point it out, this tree this morning. And he, because I leave a lot of nuts around, he came down from that tree, picked up a nut that I threw over there. And I generally throw like three to five nuts every day over there. That's Buddy. He already ate one. I don't have any nuts in my hand, which is stupid for me to be a little bit this close. But he's got a nut in his hand. Um, I threw a watermelon down there and a tomato down there. Um, so, I can't find it. There we go. Water. That's the tomato. That's the watermelon. And so there's the budster. Hold on. Uh, there we go. And so he already ate one, but another squirrel kind of chased him up the tree, and he might be eating that nut. And there's Buddy climbing the tree, so he's not going to stash it. I, I, again, some nights I think he sleeps in this tree. I wonder if that's his nest in the middle up there, right, right, right there. I'll zoom in. Wonder if that's his nest. And he's going up to the left. And I, I lost him in the tree. Oh nope, there he's I think he's right there. Does he still have the nut in his mouth? Anyway, I'm gonna leave him be. Uh, I've been out here for about twenty minutes. And uh, just, you know, just a fun little update. Uh, I also left watermelon out right here and watermelon out right there. And I threw some watermelon down right there to try to get him. I don't know. I'll probably have to give him the watermelon. I'm, I'm afraid those won't get eaten. So I'll have to just give him more watermelon or they might not get eaten by him. I'll have to just give him more watermelon when I go into my house. Uh, I mean, when he comes to hopefully visit me later. Hopefully he will. He visited me a lot yesterday. So that's just the first update for this morning.